and here we go. Perfect timing. Nice. My name is Pete. You're watching Ahead of the Curve. So I've said this many times before, and I'll say it again. The best an internal combustion engine car, most of them anyway, is ever going to get is the day you drive it off the dealership lot. The worst a good EV, such as a Tesla, is ever going to be is the day you take delivery of it. The best it's ever going to be is far into the future because you keep on getting these great free over-the-air software updates. They come periodically, just like your phone um, gets a new software update. The cars get them roughly every six weeks. I love looking, uh, I look forward to them. I love them when they come because you keep on getting that renewed new car feeling. I mean, take my Model 3 Performance, uh, which I took delivery of in September of 2019. When I'd had it, it didn't have Netflix, didn't have YouTube, didn't have a web browser, I don't think. Uh, it didn't have Tidal, didn't have Spotify. Um, now it's got Apple Music. Um, you know, one of the software updates gave it an extra 5% more power roughly and approximately five kilometers extra range. The airbags deploy differently now, so it's safer. Um, you know, I love the single pedal driving. Um, I love the ability of the car to come to me in a private car park. So like a shopping center car park from up to about 60 meters away. I've counted there's about 30 or 40 improvements that the car has had since I took delivery of it. And the other cars are no different. I'll try and show you, flip the camera around. Um, sorry about my camera work there and show you some of the release notes. So this is the latest update. So you can see Apple Music's come through. The dog mode has been improved now, so you can actually keep an eye on your dog inside the car. This is what I'm going to show you. The light show, you can coordinate it between a couple of cars now. Um, auto light, uh, auto blinkers, um, new game. Um, you, you know, you have to confirm now, or you can have the ability to confirm now. Um, to have your phone come through to the car. Previously, if you got close to the Bluetooth, will just take over. Um, so lots and lots of improvement. <laughs> um, you can um, enable fart mode or emissions testing mode, as it's officially known, known um, via the app. You can have Rainbow Road on um, all the time. And as you can see, you can flick through, and these are some of the previous software updates. Um, it shows you um, all the... Yeah, new improvements that it's had. Um, you can see Disney Plus there. So, um, yeah, absolutely love these new improvements. Um, they're fantastic. You always look forward to them. I'm going to show you a coordinated light show between two of the cars now. Enjoy. Okay, so the 2022.44.2 free over the air software update has just come through on at least two of the cars, which is great because it means we can do a coordinated light show. So if you've got a Tesla and your update hasn't come through as yet, it will probably come through in the next few days, probably before Christmas, most definitely before the end of the year, I would imagine. It seems to be very random. So this is the Model 3 Performance. It's a 2019 car. So that got the update come through on Wednesday. This is the Model Y. It's a 2022 model. That didn't come through till last night. And our 2021 um, Standard Range Plus still doesn't have it. So yeah, they obviously staggered the updates. Um, and it seems to be random. These are going to be the default light shows. If you want to know how to do a custom light show, I've put a link to a video that shows you how to do it in the description section. Here we go. Two, one. And here we go. Perfect timing. Nice. You'll notice the Model Y being a 2022 car. It's got the Matrix headlights. So you can actually spell out the word Tesla on the back of a wall. And you can see it's got the factory tailgate. So the boot is can open and close with the song. Whereas the Model 3s have got an aftermarket tailgate, so can't do that with the light show. But it can definitely open and close its mirrors and its windows. So there's the front ones. Window should come on 
coming soon as well. custom ones check out the description section below and I've put a link to a video that shows you how to do it as per usual after every light show the windows will automatically close there they go on both of the cars fantastic and the cars lock themselves of course <laughs> both in sync as well pretty cool huh I can't wait till the next Tesla meetup when we have 10 20 30 of these cars in a car park and they all come on with the light show at once in the meantime, as always, stay safe, stay sustainable, and stay ahead of the curve. Ciao.